Dubai. Dubai. United Arab Emirates. That's where I am right now. Um, this is actually the third time I've had to record this intro. Uh, the first time it hit 8 o'clock and my phone alarm started going off. The second time somebody rang the doorbell. So this is take three of this intro. Um, it's probably going to be a short video today. I just came from the Dynamite Circle Bangkok uh, conference, which is uh, where a bunch of nomads get together and they meet once a year in Bangkok, Thailand to talk about being a nomad and uh, how to improve their businesses. And I learned a bunch of stuff. Um, what I also learned is that most nomads have not been traveling uh, the way that I have been, which is um, the way I've been doing it is moving to a new city every single month. Uh, so like Vegas, you know, Chicago, New York, um, one city every 30 days making it happen and then moving on. Um, I thought that was the best way to nomad, uh, but I've been getting really burned out and I was talking to them about it and it turns out most, most nomads don't do that. They travel from between three to six months in each city, sometimes longer, uh, and really soak in the culture and like travel super slow in order to get them uh, into like the habits of working and, and making everything happen. Because um, every time you move, it really does reset your habits. Uh, like right now, I, I didn't really want to do a video today, even though it's Monday at 8 a.m. United Arab Emirates time. And it's because it wasn't a habit, so I had to force myself to do it. Um, so traveling slow is what I think I'm going to do in the future. Uh, next month, I'm going to be in San Francisco. Actually, right after Dubai, I'm, I'm there. Um, and then after that, I might move to another city, but... The next place I move, I'm going to be there for at least three months. Test longer term nomading. Um, and I can always go back after three months to one month at a time. Because this is really fun to be able to like jump to Bangkok or jump to UAE and have the freedom uh, to do it. Um, but I just thought that was an interesting point, how most of the nomads out there uh, were working remote, but they... Uh, but they didn't have to necessarily move from city to city. And that's it for today. I will talk to you tomorrow. Maybe from the top of the Burj Al Arab. I don't actually know if that's how you pronounce that. It's the tallest hotel in the world. The only seven star hotel on a rating of five stars. All right, later.